All right, how y'all doing? Yeah, it's been a while since we've had like some bloke sitting on a couch. Um, golf's going good. Everything is uh, sinking in. I think you can see that in the range. And um, the good thing is the ball is still coming out the middle and I'm not hunting for it, so distance control is good. Short game's getting getting there. Greens on our course um, just a little bit bumpy, so I have taken my putter out of the bag with the soft insert and I've gone back to my trusty Wilson uh, Napa blade. No technology in that. Hard face. Uh, forged uh, it's uh, it's an old classic actually uh, but it's great for uh, the winter and it's great for slow greens which is what we've got just now um, give it a go Friday and uh, probably keep it in the bag for the Saturday and uh, You know, it's like um, finding the time to, I think, you know, you can do it if you don't have the time. You can you can try and get yourself 10, 15 minutes, 20 minutes at the range, as long as you're doing a structure. So every time you go, you maybe don't have like an hour or two hours but if, you, if you've got a structure in place and like the alignment stick idea and you're working on something specific like you've seen in the last few videos 15 or 20 minutes over a period of days you can make a big change rather than hammering it you know for hours on end to try and effect a change like I say, everyone's got a natural swing and when you swing the weight, you kind of see what your natural swing is and uh, no matter what you do, that will always be a natural kind of swing. So if you can get a minuscule change, like, you know, like big exaggerations for a millimetre difference, in the classics, uh, you know, people have tried to change their swings in the past and I think, like, on the top of my head, possibly the only successful story was Nick Faldo and you've got to go back a while for that, but um, normally when you change your swing, you, you know, dramatically, it goes all wrong. The classic example, Sandy Lyle, he won uh, the Open, uh, won the Masters, uh, won another couple of massive tournaments, then decided, you know, my swing's not that great, I'll need to try and adjust it. It took him years and years to get back. In fact, he lost so much that he didn't really come back till he was back on the senior tour. Um, uh, Darren Clark, to an extent, had a bit of a nightmare, I think he went through the doldrums, tried to change his swing. So, you know, it's not always a good thing. But, um, we're just trying to sink things in better. And I uh, hope you can see that we're still swinging on the 45, but we're giving ourselves time. We're trying to let the club drop till, you know, the point where you can then sink the turn and the hit. And also, I'm trying to throw on my back foot, so I'm keeping my weight on my back foot a fraction longer, so I'm not like spinning out the shot, which is ain't causing me to. So uh, that's the update for today. Um, it's all pretty positive. It's all coming good. If the greens at our place would just get a little bit smoother, uh, the weather's getting there, but. Um, 
we had a lot of damage on the greens through the winter, frost and then the, the extra cold and then the snow and the ice and you know greens have uh, taken a hammer so they're not as good but uh, I reckon they'll be they'll be fine middle of June onwards so ah uh, yeah just you know we're all in the same boat just go out enjoy it and uh, I think we'll find it but um, once you start piecing all this together and watching other players do this you see a lot of similar you know connections between all the players and then you can work it out that you're not going to swing like Tiger Woods or Rory they're, they're all got their own swing Freddie Couple has got his own swing uh, I've got my own swing so what I'm trying to do is bring it out a bit, find it and bring it out and uh, refine it so it works for me. But it'll just be my swing, really. Uh, you know, your swing DNA, if you like. So thanks for watching, supporting the channel, as always, from the couch. Uh, this is for Mac Millen, Help Heroes and Shelter UK. That's where all the ad revenue goes. Uh, so your support is helping others here. Thanks for watching.